All right, so basically I have my, um, this is my scan too. I actually have two of them, but this one, I like it because it's really small and it's compact and it gets the job done and it has a really lot of information. So basically I'm plugged this up into the OBD2 port. Y'all probably can't see me doing that, but uh, it's down below. And today's vehicle is on a video is on a 2006 um 2006 Lincoln Mark LT same platform as a F150 so i have it plugged in let me make sure the music doesn't come on let me pull up the app here i'm going to show y'all what i'm working with okay. Let it load up. Let it do its thing to live data. All right, as y'all can see, the ECT is basically the engine coolant temp. That's just telling you the temperature of your coolant. And if it was, if I didn't start the vehicle and it was cold in the morning time basically you will get the same temperature as the ambient temperature which is the temperature outside um so right now i, I have a temperature of 144 and this is basically telling you the temperature of your coolant now this is also telling you that your coolant temperature sensor is working properly now as you I'm going to start the vehicle up and as I start the vehicle up and let the engine warm up, this coolant temperature is going to go up. So let's do this. All right, I just started. As you can see it's going up 145, 149. It should top out around... I don't know about 170 180 and then the um, thermostat will open and it will kind of hover around there if I'm not mistaken but I will have to check the specs on that so don't hold me to that but as you can see this is telling you a lot this is telling you the temperature of your coolant and it's also telling you that your coolant temperature sensor is working now if your coolant temperature system sensor wasn't working this would read zero 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 and therefore you need a new coolant temperature sensor 